Good morning to you, my friends. I'm Cork, and this is Valheim. Look upon my compound and weep, as I have built myself a wall on top of my moat, because it didn't quite feel uh, safe up here. I was just looking for a little extra protection, and it looks cool. So I built myself a wall and a few gates on it. So basically, I've been really, really working hard off camera to try and get things ready for today. And I have gotten myself to a point where I feel I am ready to make some progress because we've got tons of metal, absolute tons. So basically we're gonna make some metal stuff today. I wanna make some metal tools, I wanna make some armor, and then we're gonna go and explore because we have to set sail across the ocean to get to the elder i don't know anything about him but he's the next boss and i'm assuming when i have metal gear i will be properly equipped to fight the elder i also built myself the tanning rack right here so basically this uh upgrades the workbench again so now it's level three just unlocks some new recipes and stuff and uh, allows me to repair or upgrade my stuff to a higher tier which is fantastic. I also built another house right here, close to the Black Forest. And that's just a place with a bed and a few boxes. And uh, if I die, I, re will, I, I will respawn there instead of here. And then I won't have to jog all the way across the river and uh, everything is nice. And if it gets dark, I can just sleep while I'm out there. So I think we should start building some metal stuff. So it takes lots and lots of this to make bronze. But we have lots and lots. So what I want to build is a full suit of armor, a weapon, and hopefully an axe. See, I want these, I want the axe, and then I want this. Because it looks like it could be a really amazing weapon and luckily we have tons of stuff to do this with i'm carrying too much and i'm wet oh no how did that happen oh wait, no i'm sweating <laughs> oh that's funny okay let's build the armor first yes yes i don't want to build the helmet just yet you know i really should but i want to build my weapons first so we're gonna get some wood yeah I'm not gonna be able to build everything yet so I'm gonna build my where is it uh, oh we need leather instead of deer hide I'm gonna build my spear first because I feel like chopping down trees faster it doesn't need to happen yet because that's just a quality of life thing Whereas it could be that it's just a weapon and it doesn't cut down trees any faster, but I can only assume that it does. All right, I'm excited for this because this looks like it could be really fun. All right, we did it. Let's put everything away and then see how our new stuff looks. I also happened upon another troll, which gave me enough leather to make this troll hide cape. All right, let's equip all this stuff. Oh, look at my beautiful blue, blue, blue cape. I know how to say the word blue. Yes. Look at me. So shiny when I walk. Oh, goodness. This is cool. All right. I want to see my new weapon, too. Let's see it. Oh, look at this beast of a man that I have become. Yes. Okay. What kind of attacks have we got? A nice little jab, and then uh, the block. What kind of? Whoa! A roundhouse swing. Yikes! Okay, okay. This is really sweet. This is really sweet. All right. Now we need to go upgrade our uh, pole arm skill. Now I'm gonna put all my gear away because I don't need this anymore. But I'm not gonna throw it away because if I ever die and lose this stuff, I don't want to start from uh, from nothing. All right, so basically it's a uh, it's a safety. Oh no, the force is moving again. You know what? I don't really care. I've got an awesome wall, and I've also got 
my new weapons. So fight me, Grey Dwarf. That's what I thought, Grey Dwarf. Fight me. I dare you to fight me. Ouch. Stop throwing rocks. That's cheating. Yikes. Does this make me slower? I think it does. Alrighty then. That's fine. Oh yeah. We'll just uh, pick him off. Woo! This little guy is annoying. Oh yeah. Well, my biggest problem right now is stamina. Huh. Huh. Ow, that guy hurts. Ow, that guy hurts. <laughs> Ouch. The, 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 the brute is uh, no joke. I should not have unequipped my spit. Uh, bow. <laughs> I should have kept that on the hotbar. Ow. The rocks are really unappreciated. That just seems rude if you ask me. Ah. I just don't want to get poisoned because that's what really does it to you. Huh. Just keep them at a distance with your long pole arm, and we'll be just fine. You know, I couldn't have asked for a better time for a wave-based survival thing. Oh no, I got poisoned. Crumbs cakes. Take out as many as I can before I go down. Hopefully I don't go down. Okay, the forest rest again, but there's still a lot of things. All right, well, this wave went a lot more smoothly than the last one. Owie. There we go. Well, they're not running away like they did last time. I mean, I don't know if they ran away. They just disappeared, really. Huh. Huh. This pole arm is amazing. Like, oh, he's healing. Oh, I see. The gas hurts me, but it heals them. Oh, so that's why the brute has full health. Well, let's kill the shaman. Ow, brute. Don't be so brute-ish. Ow, I blocked it, but it really didn't do much. Oh, this guy hurts. Ugh. All right, just let him let him swing. Let him swing. Come on, swing at me. Yeah. And I dodge, and then I stab at thee. Ah. Okay, I did block that one. I did block that one, so I can block. Yeah. Ah, blocked. And you're dead. This gear, though, look at this amazing Viking. I am so, so powerful that you cannot even understand. All right, so this is going to go on number one, because sadly, I don't really need my shield anymore. You were a very wonderful uh, companion, shield. You served your purpose, but the time has come for me to venture on and brave the wilderness alone. So, what can I upgrade? Yes. I can upgrade that. But I need to build the piece for it. What's the piece that needs to be built? That would be the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, anvils, right? Oh, I could build that right now. You know what? I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do it. Get some wood. Get some bronze. Yes. And then, anvil. Let's put you right there in the corner. Those are very small anvils for my big viking hands. <laughs> They'll probably break in one hit, but that's okay. Now we can upgrade our spear. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. And we still have one bronze left over and a whole bunch more ore, by the way. So I spent a long time getting that. It really, it really does take a lot to get some metal, but if you can get that whole spot done, I got like 60 ore from one copper spot, so really it's not that much of an issue as it first seemed that it would be. So it turns out that we're all good. It, we're all we're all good. Okay, now that we've got that all situated, we need to discuss the buildings of a boat. How do we build a boat? Ooh, what is that? A beehive! I could build a beehive! I really want to do that, because see what happened was, I killed a bee's nest, and it gave me a queen bee. I really want to do that, because honey is really good for you. Because I got some honey from it. Oh, I want to do that. I need wood. 
It's nice having a little bit of a store of wood so I don't have to go get it every time I need it. Bees hive. Will you be mean to me? Will they poison me? I don't know. I'm going to guess you're going to be nice to me because I am your master. And obviously, since I put down this beehive, you know that I care for you and I command you. So, haha, <laughs> I am one with the bees. The bees are happy. <laughs> I have happy bees. Yes. What if they get unhappy? What do I do then? Uh oh. I don't want to have a hive of unhappy bees on my island. That could get that could get problematic. Okay. Anyways, well, I'm getting off topic. Boat. I need wood, leather, and resin. That's simple. Absolutely simple. Let's see. So my ocean's over here. But it kind of looks like it reaches all the way. So I want to build my boat over here so it's close to home. But then we could sail around. I want to know, what can you do on a boat? Can you build on the boat? Because if you can, that'd be really, really awesome. But if not, I'd be really, really sad. Let's just get an idea what kind of size we're looking at. Oh, I forgot. We need one of these. Good thing I brought extra wood. Um, okay, so it's just a little teeny tiny raft. <laughs> Alright, you know what? You know what? I like it. Because it's mine. It's my raft. <laughs> Let's take command. Oh. Ooh, this is slow. <laughs> Oh, I see I see the wind direction. Okay. Wait, can I can I unfurl the sails, please? Oh, oh. Oh, I can brace. Okay. Um, can I can I do the sails? I saw E. No, that's hold fast. Um, can I please do the sails? How does one do the sails? Oh, Oh, with up and down? Ah, okay, so it's not going to be as slow as I had previously thought. Alright. And then, um, wait. Oh, okay, there we go, there we go, there we go. What was going on? I don't know how to, uh, control the actual direction of the mast yet. Okay, hold on. Maybe we should, maybe we should hold on. <laughs> wait. Let's take a quick look at the settings. Um, ooh, uh, you can sit? That's cool. Ah, uh, do you tell me how to drive boat? Uh-oh, it does not. Okay. I was turning it. I was, oh, oh, oh. What's happening? Why does it turn sometimes, but then not others? Okay, I'm getting back to my house, because it's night time. And then I'm gonna see if I can figure out how to control a boat. Because I'm obviously clueless. Let's check on the bees. They're happy still. Good. Keep the bees happy. If the bees aren't happy, ain't nobody's happy. Okay. Now while I'm here, and it's safe inside my camp, I'm gonna look up how to drive a boat. Okay, so I was kind of right. It looks like it auto goes towards the wind, which is good. I was just not paying attention. <laughs> okay, that makes sense though. And we've got a real, real storm going on over here, yikes. I was worried about parking the boat out too far that we'd uh, not be able to get there without getting wet. But it appears it's not a problem anymore. I don't know if we're uh, really equipped to be sailing on such choppy seas. This seems foolish. <laughs> oh boy. Let's let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Look, even the deer is freaking out. He's out. He's out of here. Oh hi. You can't get me. Alright, off we go. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. The wind is really strong right now. Aye, 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 aye. We're hitting rocks. We're hitting fish. I think we're hitting fish. 
Oh, we're hitting rocks. We're good. We're good. We're at half mast. This wind is really going. Oh, uh, yes. I see the little, uh... Okay, now it makes sense. Alright, let's go full speed ahead. Oh, boy. That's a bad idea. That's a bad... Oh, that's a rock. That's a rock. That's a rock. That's a rock. We're gonna wreck. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. We're gonna beach it. Ah. Uh, it's okay. The waves will pick me up over the rock. Oh, we're tipping. Oh, boy. This is dangerous. This is scary. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. We're good. We're sailing to new lands. Undiscovered uh, places... This is great. At this point, I think this is just another river. Because there's land there. I think I should have started my raft up above, because I didn't know it was going to be this slow. Oh well, you live, you learn. Oh no. The wind is against me now. I guess we're rowing. So we just need to keep going along this river until we get to the open ocean. These waves are so intense. I wish this storm would calm down a little bit. Like, for real? And also, why can't the wind just go that way? That way, please. It's going directly against me. Like, it could not be any more against me if it wanted to be. Well, that's okay. I'm a strong Viking man. I can paddle through the fiercest of storms, as you are seeing right now. Look at all the pigs. It's a pig migration. This is crazy. Why are there so many pigs? There's like 10,000 pigs over there. Go home, pigs. Oh, they're getting swept up by the water and then placed back down. <laughs> That's so funny. They're like a fishing bobber. <laughs> That's really funny. Oh, I love that. I love that a lot. The storm surges. Oh, there's a sand. Oh, boy. I wonder... Is that little damage number coming up? Damage of my boat? Probably. Oh boy, we're really hitting a land bridge here. Come on, some of, where are these big waves to lift me up over? Okay, so here's the play. Here's the play. We're gonna head to my outpost house, and we're gonna sleep there, and hopefully the thunderstorm will have stopped. And at this point, we can use the wind a little bit to bring us safely into port. What's this music? All of a sudden, this trumpet starts playing. Oh, that's okay. Is the storm letting up? Oh! Oh! The sunshine! It's beautiful! Oh! I never thought I'd see the sun again! Oh! Looks like I've turned another page in my story. It's gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be okay. <laughs> well, let's go see my outpost house. I shall introduce you to it. It's not its not fantastic, but I call it home. There she is. Look at the beauty. The comfort of home, but not at home. In the utilitarian place. How nice. Ah, warm fire and a nice bed. I don't think it's nighttime yet. So I don't think I can sleep. Will this just bring me to night? I hope not. Bring me to the next morning, please, so that I have plenty of daylight to explore. Now, we need to set out straight west of here. This is going to be a long journey. You know what? <laughs> I've thought better about taking my super fantastic gear that I worked really hard to get across the ocean to a place where I will most likely die. So I'm going to leave most of it here. Because I'm not a fool. I'm not a fool. There we go, that's better. Nice. All right, on the boat. Off we go. 
You know, let's reverse this thing. All right, we're on for a long journey today. And the wind is against us pretty much perfectly. Pretty much perfectly. This is going to be slow. Why is the wind always against me, stupid wind? What is wrong with you? Ah, I feel like I'm playing Sea of Thieves again. Oh, the wind did turn. It turned all the way to the left. Oh, what if we turn a little bit this way? Oh, ocean. It's actually got a biome. Okay. That's cool, I guess. What if we uh, do the sails now? Will that go faster? Hmm. I hope there's no, like, uh, Kraken out here, or Kraken, or whatever you want to call it. That'll uh, come up and get me. Or sharks, really, because uh, I am quite vulnerable on this little teeny tiny raft. There's land over there. I think. I can't see anything ahead of me. I feel like this is just 100% ocean. <laughs> That's not great. It could be better. Especially if the wind was behind me. Boy, oh boy, do I wish it was behind me. Maybe I should head over there. I don't know. What is that? <laughs> I don't know what it is. Okay, we're gonna go for it. Is that like 10,000 miles away and it only looks close because I'm really dumb? I don't know. <laughs> oh well, we'll find out. Hey, we're out exploring, it doesn't matter. Ooh, I see a tree. It must be close. Close-ish. Let's, let's hope, let's hope. Yeah, it's just far enough away that things haven't rendered on yet. Unless it's just a deserted island and there's only one tree on it. <laughs> oh, there it is. There it is. There's the rest of it. It looks like more black forest. Okay. Okay. Hopefully this connects up with the landmass that the uh, outer is on. It kind of doesn't look like it, though. <gasps> oh, the wind is turning. Yes. Guide me to my destination. Finally, we've got some proper speed. It's not really that much faster. <laughs> what is this? Come on, let's go! Land ho! Beautiful, beautiful land. Look at this. We made it! Not exactly where we were going, but... We survived. We survived. Countless hours on the sea rowing manually because the wind won't cooperate. Even now that it's directly behind me, we seem to be going at a snail's pace. I probably am supposed to build a longboat to get out over the ocean. But the elder is over there. I have to go. Oh no, oh no. Oh well. No biggie. This is looking beautiful. I could eat, but I will not until we reach the promised land look at the beautiful birds they sing my song of victory what a song it is what a victory it was the battle is won yes I am safe in my new home this is not my new home I will never stay here alrighty then well, that was a journey. Woo! We didn't quite get where we wanted to go. But this is going to have to be a pit stop in the journey. We'll make the rest of it next time, because I've got to go. Well, this is a nice little place. Pretty nice, pretty nice. We might build an outpost here, maybe. Can we build... Let me just first of all see. Building... Um, yeah, it kind of looks like that's a no on the building on the raft. That's okay. I didn't expect it to be a yes. <laughs> Anyways, I think we're going to call this episode here. We're going to stop on the ground so that nothing bad happens to me. Hopefully my raft does not float away. Well, 
That was cool. We built some bronze gear. We got some better armor and an amazing weapon. And we're on our way to find out what we need to get to summon the next boss. And we'll find that out next time. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this episode of Valheim. If you did, leave a like. And if you haven't already and you would like to, you can subscribe to see more of Valheim and all the other things I post right here on this channel. And as always, guys, in case I don't see you, good afternoon, good evening, and good night.